which is in fact The Sims 4. Yay! <laughs> um, so I'll load that up. Uh, it's fine, it's fine, come on. Okay, calm, calm yourself, guys. Sorry, I'm talking to the app, it's getting nasty with me. There we go. Now you're open. Okay, that's fine, that's fine. <clears throat> we just move us on over to the Sims Fort, which I'll wait for a second just for us to actually get into the family and playing. So as we are waiting, um, I'm actually going to be playing uh, some Rags to Riches. Um, money in a struggle while painting. Um, so I'm sorry for the random change and you may not be nearly as interested in this game, I do apologise. Um, unfortunately things do just sometimes go wrong. Um, and we can't play the games we want to. And that is okay, okay, okay. So we're going to be playing some Rice Riches, so let me just load in the game. Wow, that game is so loud now. I'll just turn that down on your side because I turned it up for Prison Architect and well... Wow! Okay, so let me just transition over to The Sims 4 for you guys. Here we are! Uh, welcome to The Sims 4! This is the other half of my six hour live stream. So <laughs> we're gonna do some rags to riches, which should be very fun. Now, if you are here from Twitch, I'm saying this because this is gonna be uploaded to YouTube. Uh, the beginning of this is gonna be split because I'm gonna split them into the games I played. Obviously, the first game I played is uh, <laughs> not, I'm not counting Prison Architect in this, <laughs> which I did attempt to play. Oh, and you'll be able to enjoy watching me eat pasta if that's like your weird thing. Do 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 do. Still very loud in my ears. Oof. Ba -da -da -da. So here we are in um. Wow, this is my sim self. Uh, she was not this thick. Um. This is not an accurate representation of my body weight anymore, but she has been eating and to be honest, you currently may not be able to eat every day because we are rags to riches. Now if you weren't here for the very first uh, ever time I played this, basically this was my, uh, the last stream I did this in, it was my first ever time doing rags to riches and we're currently trying to do a restaurant, which is why we're on a restaurant lot, which you could see by me being able to flip the money, uh, as opposed to a normal house. But the plan is, to have her house up in like quite a small house basically maybe a cottage it does not look like a cottage at the minute i will admit that it looks a little rough um but it'll be like a little cottage a uh, cottage surrounded by trees with a path and then oh my god that's a cat and then the restaurant off the other side whose cat is this this is stray well very red are you okay anyway let us speed through the night this is someone who's literally been staying at our house this entire time and honestly tempted to start trying to date her because she won't go away. We actually have all the um, major amenities that we need at this point. So we have a fridge so we can get food. We have a toilet and a shower so we don't have to worry about any of that. Uh, the only thing is we don't have social and fun really except from painting if that's class is fun. I'd love you to sell that to a collector when you've opened up which honestly you could do now. Um, after that you can go to the toilet and I'd appreciate it if you went in and got yourself a quick meal of animal crackers. Which honestly sounds kind of tasty and I don't know why you wouldn't want it. Um, but no, I... Oh, 
Like, oh, she's also gonna need a shower because she is one stinky, stanky girl. Wow. Uh, ba da Abstract painting seems to be doing the best. I'm gonna get her to do a large abstract because she actually does have the money. We also sold Cameron's painting, so like, ah uh, ha ha. Uh, we got all her money. Um, so my, <laughs> the traits I picked myself were geek, creative, and cat lover. I'm also a muser because I want to be a painter extraordinaire. Which is kind of accurate. I'm going to be going on to a graphic design course uh, this September. So I'm looking forward to that quite a bit. Um, but very soon. Also, Cameron. Lovely. You are getting us money. And I so appreciate that by just painting stuff. So do you know what? We're going to do a little bit of a risky question. I know I had myself over flirt for so long just then, but... Risk gay is a lot more fun. <laughs> I have a feeling I won't be able to keep this energy up through the rest of this, but to be honest, for someone who's already streamed for three hours, I feel like so energetic and it's actually great because sometimes I'll start these and I'll be like, I am tired, but I've actually been up for a decent amount of time before starting to stream today. Whereas usually I find that I am waking up at about 2 p.m. and then streaming at 8. So I haven't been like as awake in the day as you can see it's actually still light outside which is surprising even though it's eight it's half eight so it would be usually for the beginning my lighting is going to get really weird later it's actually been pretty all right to begin like throughout this so far uh but the light in here doesn't work <laughs> that'll be rectified in a couple weeks when um i'm not here anymore <laughs> are you going to ask her this risque question or not the answer is no. Please finish your painting, actually. I'd prefer you to finish that before I do this. Do you know one thing I haven't I have done like quite a bit? Uh, I did for a long time the um the 100 baby challenge. And I spent quite a while doing that. I don't think she liked my uh, risky question. I'm also gonna sell that yeah, she did not. Maybe we're just meant to be friends. But no, I was going to turn this into like her room. Uh, it, obviously, I'm actually going to give her a bit of a bigger house. I'm actually tempted to give her like a loft, essentially. Like a loft room. Um, and I'd love to have the money to just build right now, but I don't really. Uh, I also said I was going to start focusing on the restaurant as a way to bring in money. But honestly, I'd rather get the house done and then um, continue doing this. Also, that's a really good point. I'm gonna need to get a, uh, it shouldn't be too expensive. And also now that I'm going into build by mode, um, I should be able to do some building. Also, um, I've just remembered, I mentioned earlier about, oh, I don't actually have enough for it. Oh, it's cause I haven't got it in my uh, restaurant funds. Uh, 590 please. Oh no, I need to do a uh, 490, confirm. Uh, I did mention this, that I was having seemingly a lot, a lot of lag in the last time I played this game, and it turns out that was actually a problem that a lot of people were having with this game. I, it seems to be a lot less at the minute, so I'm quite happy about that. I don't know why it's not nearly as much, but I'm not going to complain, complain. I'm not sure if we actually have to pay um, bills on this slot. So I think what I'm going to do is this was originally going to be a bedroom, but that's fine. Because um, if I move, whoops, move the door over here and I might make the stairs. Um, okay, you know what? The door's just going to go in the wall for now. I don't even think I have enough for stairs. I want it to be a cottage, so in my head it would have, like, wood, like, carpeted stairs? Like, I don't know why, but carpeted? Um, or, like, nice-looking stairs, basically. Like, I want a cottage. I'm not sure, like, what gives me cottage feels. Honestly, these do give me cottage feels. And I love this colour wood. 
Oh, I can't in intersect it with the roof. Which honestly I did not put a lot of time into making. Um, that just wasn't obvious there. Um, I'm gonna need to move this out. I mean, I wanted to do it like that. And I think the door can actually fit. What object are you intersecting with right now? Oh, it'd be the toilet. It can fit there, though. Oh, I forgot that was a new feature from the game. Nice. I like, I like. So I was originally going to have it all white, so maybe I have picked, like, the worst possible colour. But, like, in my head, like, a cottage is, like, quite, like... I don't know. It also probably wouldn't have these stairs, but these really remind me of my grandma's stairs. Um, so I don't know. But no, essentially, oh, that doesn't make a lot of sense to where I was going to have this as like a side area. I suppose what I could do though is, let's say, okay, I don't actually have the ability to put that on just yet. That doesn't feel very cottage-like. Um, this would be better. But also, like, not. Didn't realise I was going to have to pay for the roof, by the way. Maybe if I just bring this one... Yeah, the stairs are gone, I've just realised. Like, it could only go along this... Whoops. Like, it'd only be along this one. Which doesn't look very good if I decide to put it there. So that would mean the stairs would have to go somewhere else. Um, like theoretically they could go there and it'd be a loft to the room. So it'd be like this and then you'd have this here. Obviously I don't know how this is gonna work if I don't bring that all the way down. Well that wasn't very smooth now was it? And then bring it across like that and then just bring it in on that one particular side. I do want to bring this out everywhere and then just maybe I need to bring it out instead. Yeah. That doesn't feel very cottagey to me though. Oh, I know it would actually help if I just copy this one. Oh, I know why it feels wrong. It's because this is not gonna be there like that. Although I still think that would be more cottage-like anyway. This is gonna be a wall. <laughs> Um, which I actually kind of forgot that it was going to be. Um, I don't know why I can't go up and actually put this on top of it. Like, <laughs> I should be able to. But no, that'll look better. I'm trying to go for, like, very small... Ooh, did I just delete that? Uh, kind of like a small sort of thing you know just a very small house so this is gonna be the kitchen over here eventually and then the like i said the bedroom will be upstairs i'm not sure how i'm gonna do it though because the stairs would come also apparently i got rid of the stairs this would come here so i guess the bed would be there um kitchen would be here and then little dining room and maybe unless i put the kitchen as you walk in but i also feel that would be kind of odd and then the bathroom will have to become a full bath. So whether or not I'd leave this here, I, I could, theoretically. Obviously not right now, because I don't have the money to. Um, but yeah. She doesn't have a job, so I don't even have to worry about any of that stuff. But yeah, eventually it's going to have a bunch of things, which honestly I'll probably use 
debug for. That's so cute. I actually love that and want to keep it, but I can't. Do you know what? We are going to keep this one and simply for the for the fact of one, it's oh, it's worth 307 though. Oh, that's kind of frustrating, but I want to keep it because I was going to do like a cat themed sort of restaurant, even though this looks like it should not be cat themed. Um, but mainly just she has a cat, or I want to eventually have a cat because I love cats, as you can tell by the cat lower trait I have, or at least for it to go in her room. You know, also don't mind the fact the roof is there, it's fine, it's okay. That's an interesting painting. Also, I actually really love this. It's really cool for an abstract painting. It's not like too abstract. This one's worth nearly as much. Luckily, she doesn't have much emotion and we can just keep doing this. Again, not actually the way I wanted to originally do this. I was gonna just do a restaurant, which is why we even have the lot in the first place. But this is definitely quicker. see. We actually are painting level 7, which I'm kind of shocked about. Um, other than that though, we haven't got many skills. I mean, I did get the writing skill because- wow, what is that? Um, because I was like, oh, writing books, that's a good way to start, right? Not the best, I'll be honest. Also, like, I want her to leave- oh, I've just realized because she doesn't have a full roof anymore. She's getting, like, snowed in on, but she doesn't have a seemingly a problem with that. Why is that worth 373 simoleons? Why? Why was it? Also, I have to complete three emotional paintings, which is why I'm doing this. <laughs> I want to also get a satisfactory up, you know? And honestly, I don't think it's gonna- it's cheating in my opinion to get things like Oh, never weary and all that stuff. Oh, also, I forgot about the frogs. Uh, the frogs are a decent amount, so... Also, I'm actually... I am actually collecting these to put in the restaurant. So it may be like a restaurant with like a couple different rooms, I think. See, playing Sims and building this way, like Rice to Riches way, really gives me that like feeling of um of like ah uh what's it called playing like minecraft survival mode and building and like your main goal is to build things which may sound like a completely weird sentiment but like it does if you don't agree that's fine but i personally think it's kind of the same i did become friends with cameron page she is very pretty i do agree uh, we'll sell that to Collector, and then you can actually sleep, because you are absolutely knackered. You also really need a piss, and you need to go, like, have a meal. Like my painting, Cameron. Also, I still believe, well, I don't like a lot of colourful swatches, because... The problem with colourful swatches like this is none of the other hairs match them and I have to have them match. But like, I absolutely think this is so gorgeous. It's stunning. Like, it feels like the right amount of muted as well because it's not bright colours and it's all pastel and I love it. I probably wouldn't do it to my own hair. I think my own hair is probably a little bit too dark and maybe if I tried to dye it too, like, light enough to do something like that, it would turn to hay. Um, <laughs> but if I could pull it off and I didn't have to worry about going into work and stuff, um, because I'm hoping to get a job and unfortunately a hair colour like that would probably stop me from being able to get a job. Um, I probably would. I'd play around with my hair much more than I do now. Which, funnily enough, I did actually play around with my hair quite a bit when I was younger. Um, but then as I got older, I stopped doing that because I was... I was like, I've dyed it too many times, I'll cut all the dye out, and 
that that will be that, you know. And then I'll grow it out. So I'm currently trying to grow it out a lot. My hair was up here two years ago. Um. Hell yeah. But that is that. I'm not sure how loud this game is for you guys, so I'm just gonna turn it up a little bit. Okay, I'm gonna have a sleep. I genuinely don't know why she's just staying here, and I really hope she doesn't die, because then I would have to make my way up to getting the um, ambrosia to bring her back, because I'd actually feel really guilty uh, if she died on oh my lot. Hey, Luminous, welcome back! How have you been? You missed. I uh, did play Final Fantasy X 2 yesterday. I am now in chapter 5, and there's so many side quests. <laughs> kind of scared me. Why do you have a gun, Lilith? Why? 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 Like, what even? Why are you in my house? I'm doing good, yeah. <laughs> uh, doing a six hour stream today, so it's been interesting. We played some of the um, Escapist 2 earlier, which was a little awkward to get used to, and multiplayer has a few issues because Epic doesn't allow you to invite friends yet, the launcher, because the Escapist 2, by the way, if you don't know, because I don't think me or Sam mentioned it earlier when we were playing it, uh, it is free on the Epic launcher, so go ahead and play it. I have caught up, yes. Um, I'm currently doing the side quest, which I got to it and I was like, oh, there is so much that you can do in this chapter. And I was like, oh no. And it panicked me a little bit. And the temptation, because of how hard it is to level characters up at this point, uh, their skills anyway, I was just like, maybe if I just complete the game and start back up at level one, you know, <laughs> it'll be fine. But then I'm also like, but what if I haven't got high enough levels or skills yet to do anything? <laughs> but that's been my life with Final Fantasy X 2 recently. A little bit scared, but it's okay. <laughs> no worries, go help your mom, that's alright, don't you worry. Also, I appreciate the tips. <laughs> But Final Fantasy is a very good game. Any of them, really. I say any of them. I haven't played all of them. So that's probably a really bad statement to say. Final Fantasy X 2, in my opinion, is a really good game. Um, I have over 30 hours in the game, so I really enjoy it, <laughs> as you may tell. And I say over 30, but that's in this one playthrough. I played through the game, never completed it, but I have played the game quite a bit. Why have you also got a gun? And why are you coming into my house? If you use that gun, you're just going into my fridge. Oh, that is glitchy. This is not a restaurant. This is my house. Why are they just... We're not even open. I can't open. Like, what is going on? What's the reason? Why are people just in my house? Please leave. Can I, like, ask them to leave, please? I gave up with Cameron because I was like, she's fine. You finished a masterpiece? It is, like, this is honestly the, uh, the Sims Mona Lisa. Like, it is, in fact, very much so. The Sims Mona Lisa. I'm just gonna put up my walls and stuff so I can take a nice little picture here. Sims Mona Lisa. Perfect. Anyway. Let's sell it. Oh, look at all that cash. I can't wait, because what it'll mean is I'll be able to do some stuff with the house. Uh, yes, I do. I have to question why wouldn't I want to sell it? Also, I swear I asked her to do a large, um... Painting, but I guess I didn't. <laughs> also, what this means is I'm actually going to jump into build and buy and hopefully set up the second floor of the house and not the restaurant, which sounds ridiculous, but it is very true. Uh, I'll move over just 2,000. It's probably best to um, 
leave some in her thing so that, you know, she can uh, afford to paint and such. Let me just build a handy little wall here. I'm actually very impressed that I was able to do that just then. It doesn't need to be too big and honestly, why does it keep doing that? Like, we should have another floor, I was going to say. Um, and then, I like want to make it more interesting, but at the same time I don't know if this is going to look very good. Um, if I actually do this. Because I'm not much of a builder. It just feels too, like, narrow. Almost, to be able to do it. Um, I'd like it if it wouldn't... Well, I built two. That's not what I wanted. Like, it looks a little silly. And it probably doesn't help that that's actually hanging over it. Um... I was going to bring these two walls forward, by the way, if you thought that looked a bit weird. Like, it could be something like that, but I feel like it looks odd. Because, like, the other thing I could do, I like the side, that's fine. Then again, most people probably wouldn't do that for their side. I want it to be like a little house, basically, and I could, if I actually paint it, it might help my vision. The only other thing I can think of doing would be, okay, this is going to seem so weird when I do it at first. I've never tried to do this before either, so we're going to be learning some new stuff today. Uh... I'm thinking of basically putting in like a little balcony. Um, and then another one. So like that. And then I also don't know if they all have these roofings. I also need to put the trim on it, which is another thing that I don't know which trim I've used. But then it could be like a little like balcony in here. Which doesn't feel very cottagey, I will admit. Like, I'll be the first one to admit that that doesn't feel very cottagey. <sighs> I actually really like that, that's kind of fun. But not quite the uh, fencing I'm looking for. Hey, you're back. Nice. Okay, so the fencing doesn't work. Apparently, uh, from what I understand, I don't know if you can actually put fencing against walls or not. You've been waiting for me to catch up. <laughs> Fair. But no, only, only just have I. Uh, uh. Sam, you alright? Yeah, yeah. yeah, one second. I will answer that question just one second. Oh, that is so much pasta. Are you okay? I put too much in. Did, how much did you put in? A quarter of a pound. Oh my god, okay. <laughs> Thank you. There are surprises at the bottom. Okay, yeah. Sorry, this is my dinner. I've been going for uh, nearly four hours. Um, uh, so my levels currently are uh, just getting into the 60s, I believe. Um, I think they've all just got into like level 60-ish. Other than Yuna, she's probably still on level 59. <laughs> Um, I'll be right back. I do need to very quickly uh, jump to the bathroom. I say jump. I'm not actually going to be jumping. But I will be back in just one moment. Please give me a couple of seconds. It's like, go. <laughs>
Do you know what? I sat down <laughs> and I went to myself. I'm muted, I must remember. And then I got distracted by food. I got distracted by changing back over to the game. So thank you very much, Luminous. <laughs> I appreciate. <laughs> I'm usually good at it. Not not then apparently. Thank you. Um But no, I was basically just re saying that uh yeah, my characters are level uh like sixties something. Okay, that is definitely not where I want that wall to be. It needs to be like on a half tile, which is incredibly frustrating. It happens. <laughs> Thank you. I'm glad it happens and it's not just me. <laughs> oh, wait, I know a way how I might be able to fix this. I am a silly, silly one. Look at that. Look how much better that looks. Okay. <laughs> Whoops, not there though. This should really become a room. Thank you. And now I can put a normal wall here. You hit chapter 5 at level 50 is nice. I was doing a little bit of grinding to be fair though. Um, because I was um, level grinding my levels base- um, sorry I was skill grinding and my levels obviously went up so that's what happened there. <laughs> but I'm glad it seems like a decent level to be at. I'm not sure why these... Okay, I'll just do that then. I actually didn't know that's how you did that. Um, that was news to me. Okay, so that looks pretty good. I'm gonna go ahead and make sure that's got that on and that's also got that on. I think it may look quite nice. Do you know what? I should probably be building this in light so I can see what's going on. Uh, the trim I'm gonna want to give that though is not that trim. Not sure how to do those trims actually. Oh, it's down here. That makes more sense. Maybe a thicker trim actually. But in white, I don't know if there is a thicker trim. I mean, that's kind of a thicker trim, but I'm trying to match it to that. <laughs> I'm attempting to stir in the sauce. Uh, your first chapter of Five Grinds what was Mushroom or Rock? Um, I clean the forest if you can't handle the rock road. Interesting. Okay, I'll have to try that. Um, I'm currently doing all the hotspots I have because nearly everywhere but Carmine's end up as a hotspot for me. Which I was very annoyed about <laughs> because what that means is I haven't done ever I didn't do everything in earlier chapters. Currently level sixty is grinding to level seventy in the far plane abyss. Interesting. I haven't even gone there yet. I'm just currently going through this, <laughs> avoiding it uh, to a certain degree. Because I was going through two ideas of do I just try and complete it or do I do all the side quests now? Because there's no way I'm getting 100% unfortunately I've realised at this point. Because um, if you don't get a hot spot everywhere you don't get 100% which made me sad. <laughs> I should be able to handle it, okay. I may just do that the next time I play them. So I swear there's another version of this door, but, like, because this door is that door that's up there, that I've just stuck up there. But I'm pretty sure there's one with, like, windows either side of it. I may be getting it wrong. I think I might have. I may be confusing it for that door. Which isn't really the door I want. I also can't afford any other doors right now. I 
Also, I feel like to get this cottage vibe, I'm probably gonna need to have a balcony. Uh, not a balcony, sorry. A, uh, like, oh, that is not the one I wanted. I wanted this one. A, like, I don't know how to explain it. Like, a little wraparound porch with some actual things. Is it really? Okay, that's good to know. I was curious about whether it would be useful or not, but I've kind of stopped using it anyway. Um, I've got... Uh, Yuna's completely done trainer. Now she's maxed out in that. Um, Riku and Pain are still both working on their Berserker. It's taking a really long time. There is one of those skills that, take, that needs 300 AP. And then once you've done that one, another one unlocks that's 400 AP, which I was like, ah. Um, and it took a really long time to get those. Uh, well, I say those. I got the 300 one on Riku. Pain hasn't got it yet. Uh, and I'm now just starting Yuna up on Berserker. Um, health is a massive problem in this game. Like, I do... It just takes a long time for some of them to actually do things, which I, which makes sense as to why it isn't great in that regard. Ah, oh, I want to do like a wraparound, but I don't honest. I honestly don't think I've got enough for it. Just realized this doesn't quite match. Like, I want it to kind of wrap like this far around. Like, all the way. But it doesn't make sense because I haven't got any roofs. So maybe not. I don't know. I'll figure it out another time. Um. But Berserkers are actually overpowered. I I do agree that they're extremely overpowered. Like at this point, just their normal attack is doing around two like two thousand three like two thousand but between two thousand usually or just just below to around four thousand damage. Just their standard attack almost all the time. <laughs> yeah. I know you weren't able to get it. Um, definitely go for it on your um, New Game Plus, though. You'll probably find that it helps you a lot. <coughs> oh my god. <coughs> I just choked on sauce. <coughs> sorry. Um, you'll find it will help a lot, sorry, is what I meant to say then. I still feel like this looks weird. And it may be because of how tall that is. Or maybe because it hasn't got any windows and this bit is really thin. Like, it feels too big at that point. And that needs to be that size. Do you know what? Let's go inside of it instead of sitting out here on the outside constantly. I actually do need to fix something with the pool papers, I've realised. I need this one up here. Um, what? Why did nothing change? It should have. Oh, it's changed on the sides. That's fine. It just didn't change it there, because that's technically not the edge of it. I guess. <laughs> but like, uh. Sorry, I am also trying to eat dinner, so I do apologize. You should probably get back into The Sims. It is good. Um, although apparently The Sims 4 is having some glitches, and I've seen maybe one or two of them. At, um, not in this playthrough, but in other times I've played, so 
I don't know why it's having glitches though. Um, but all in all, it usually is a very workable game. <laughs> usually it doesn't have too many problems. I wish there was a carpeted stair. But there isn't. And I don't necessarily like how dark that is. Are they just not the same colour? Okay, so I can't do this inside. That's fine. And then this can be the bedroom, although actually that's not... Hmm... That doesn't work. Unless maybe I do it this way. And I don't think that'll work either. <laughs> Extreme violence is very fun um, for this game if you're into that sort of thing. Um, oh, that works better. And then just delete that bit. Um, and then that could theoretically be the wall, you know. Oh my god, not what I meant to do at all. Um, I want that to be a fence, pretty much. So, Although, what's the point in having the balcony if I'm doing this? I've just realised a problem. <laughs> um, but I do have extreme violence in this. It can be fun to use, but I've been worried about the idea of using it on stream because it's a little gory. Um, I also haven't done one where I'm just like, yeah, this is something I'm going to use, you know? But no, I can't really use that if I do it this way. Unless I do this the opposite way around. Hmm. Okay, that is actually... Well, it's something I'm actually going to have to live with that I've done. Uh. I'll just remove it. Let's go down. You mean like, this is fresh to Rich's, uh, builds a bunch. Because <laughs> I can stick the stairs like there, and then... But this doesn't do anything of what I was trying to do. I was basically trying to create like a loft bedroom and like it has not turned out whatsoever. <laughs> just gonna move where I've got my dinner. So then maybe I can eat it a bit better. This is also not very lit up, so I do apologize. There's no point in having the balcony here if it is not gonna get used, you know? Like, that used up so much of my money. But then this also makes it kind of awkward to put a bed in here. I mean, it does fit here and you could have a desk and a wardrobe there. Um, well, Cause this is centered, unfortunately, I don't know. Could even stick a wardrobe there maybe. So it works, <laughs> I guess. Um, like, that feels very weird, but it is also just an up to the room, so it does feel very Sims 3. I will say that, it feels like a Sims 3 thing. That's probably better. It looks more like a stair thing then. Uh, and I'll get the matching bar, which is... Doesn't exist? Did I actually use a vampire one here? No, I did. I always use this accidentally without realising that I'm using it. It's just a nice stair. <laughs> like, a stair bar. I'm gonna take another bite of my pasta. Mmm. Unfortunately, eating happens when you do a longer stream. Mm. I 
mean, the dining table would be here, living room would be here, and then I'd... Now that I actually have this, I can technically move this stuff upstairs anyway. Um, even the easel should probably just go up here. Um, and the painting, so I don't forget that it's not getting sold. <laughs> this would accept, ex, accept, ex, I don't know what the word was. Um, and then this would end up being the kitchen. Um, this is the bathroom, so it's going to be like your main bathroom. So eventually, I'd like have this here, have sink, shower, essentially. Would be the ideal. Although, the only way I can do that is by putting it along here, and then honestly, we could make this come out. I have some actual real good custom content uh, kitchen stuff for this. Like, one of these could go over the top of the fridge, so it makes sense, and then this can be the actual thing. And then that way, although... The reason why I'm thinking this is because it will go up to the roof. Not that we have the simoleons to even be thinking about this at the minute. Uh, this is the house. I am planning to do a restaurant, which is why I'm building it on here. Um, wow, everything went super quick just then. But she does have a bed upstairs now, which is nice, because it's out of the way. I've got two people at my house who have guns, which is honestly kind of frightening. Um... I'm just gonna keep prodding it past her. Play The Sims 4 for five hours. I have been playing this game way more hours than you think I have, buddy. Okay, so we have an unfinished kitchen, an unfinished living room. I think the next thing would be probably to get a TV, which I honestly would put on this wall. We shouldn't need a bathroom any bigger than what we currently have, so that should be all right. Oh, the easel's upstairs now. I was like trying to look for it and I was like so confused. I was like, 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 like. You haven't played it since you were 12 or 13. So, I'll be honest, <laughs> it doesn't tell me too much as I don't know how old you currently are, but I assume that's a decently young age for you. Um, so dang. <laughs> I grew up on The Sims and playing it and I've had periods where I've stopped for a couple months, well I say a couple, but like six months to however long. I always end up coming back to it though. It's also a decent enough game to stream I found, um, just in terms of, because you can kind of do whatever you want with it. <laughs> the way I see Sims, it's one of those games that it only stops being fun when you decide it does to a certain degree she says having gotten bored of the sims as soon as she's opened the game but because <laughs> you can always come up with stuff for example because of mods i'll be honest mods really do help this game i could come over here just be like oh and oh and then you know we could do some damage um <laughs> But I'm not going to, it's fine. I should probably get a better bed at some point because for some reason she actually does get a sore back on this bed. Um, also a double bed because I'd eventually like her to have kids even though it's my sim self and that's really weird to think about. Um, but hey, it's a sim self and not actually me, so it's fine. <laughs> More ravioli in my bowl. I'm assuming the ravioli is only in this, um, because it was the easiest way to get a sauce. <laughs> oh. 
I also have a feeling that you put a little bit of ketchup in it because I feel like I can taste it. Which is fine. I like it. It's good. I appreciate you for making my dinner so much. Doing these paintings are really making a lot of buck. Uh, currently. So that's good. Also, these people are definitely, like, stuck at my house. Oh, I'm paying another one. Okay, yeah, we'll sell this one. Chevron was more expensive. Oh. I'm trying to think of a way I could fit like a little toilet up here. Like even just a toilet and a sink. But unless I bring it out and do like a three way, like a three long room, I don't think I can because obviously this is on a half tile. Which it's, I'm really happy that the Sims decided to do it. But it does mean that you can't put walls in certain places anymore. It feels like she's like holding this gun up like up to me like you must paint. So this will be the thumbnail I guess. Okay, that's fine. I feel like that's enough. <laughs> if, oh, it's it's a cover for her phone. Oh no, that was her playing on her phone while having the object in her hand. Never mind. Still a gun, guys. <laughs> Mab oh. uh, I feel like in actions so there should be a ask to leave. Ask to leave please. Is there really not an ask to leave button? Go away. I'm gonna be mean to a vampire, which I feel like- a vampire who has a gun, which honestly not the best bit. Everyone else has left, that's good to know. She's also gonna need to sleep soon. Another reason why I think it'd be better to have a double bed, because everyone comes and sits on her bed, because it's like the only thing to sit on. I do apologize for eating, but I am hungry. Go away. Also, another very pretty painting, but it's not cats, so it's fine. Oh. Oh, she took away my opportunity to paint. Hey, at least I'll get the money for it. Right. You painted in my house, not the other way around. So it's not cheating for rags to riches, in my opinion. Then again, I never have looked at the official rules for this. But I have watched many of the challenge. Well, people doing the challenge, I suppose. I just hope sharing is caring doesn't pop up. 
because apparently the sharing is caring. Um, neighborhood action thing is a little broken. It's not broken, but basically it means that your neighboring sims can just come into any lot and steal the stuff, including from restaurants and um, like venues, which breaks them, and you can't use them for how they're meant to be used. So that's great. <laughs> Not quite how I think that was meant to work, but it is what it is. Definitely gonna want to get her a better bed. Oh, they're having a fight. Can you not break my fridge, maybe? Their page up key is really getting sticky. I don't know why. Can you stop leaving glass, like juice glasses everywhere? I'm also going to need to use the bathroom at this point. They can break the fridge. It's not fair. And look at all the rubbish they're leaving here. Who are you? I am so confused. I know, right? Like, I can't even get them to, like, leave. Like, I could go in probably and remove them, but at the same time it's like, come on, leave please. It is not fair, I did not ask you to come here. The only one I actually let be here was a Cameron. And I initially didn't let her be there. Well, peanut butter and Jam sandwich. Because I'm British. Okay, and in this, really, I'm gonna have her come up here and paint more. Um, because she's feeling good now. Do 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 do. Eating pasta. But for every um, 100 she spends, she makes 200, so I'm not going to complain too, too much. I just want everyone to leave, but I won't. Yes, a masterpiece! Amazing, okay. We have quite a lot of simoleons here. Let us just go ahead and transfer, we'll do 3,500, oh god, okay there we go, three, <laughs> uh, just to save ourselves in case I accidentally mess this up basically. Counters are really expensive, um, 
But honestly, it's about time. That we get an oven or something. There's not that much of a difference. Well, actually, they're exactly the same. One just looks a lot nicer. Not even gonna lie. Uh, I reckon if I stick that there, I can put a sink there, and that will probably be the best bet I have. Um, in terms of cabinets, I kind of like these, the idea of like a cottagey area, although these are also super, super nice. <laughs> Basically, which one matches the stairs better? Will not be able to tell. Uh, it'll probably be these ones though. Also, I'm gonna just turn auto counters on for now. These are very expensive. Um, not gonna lie though. Um, but no, that's big enough for a sink, which I like. Um,. This one. Which can then go there, and then we can actually uh, get a dishwasher maybe. Oh, which I actually thought I was going to completely run asunder, but apparently not. Would I like to have a range of? Yes. May not quite fit the aesthetic. Like I said, I cannot see in here. They won't match, unfortunately. You have to find cabinets with a wood that match! Oh no! If this matches, these are the matching cabinets, I think. Um, but I need the short one. Fortunately, it's not thick enough to actually cover that in the way I'd like it to. So I may just have to leave them off of it. Also, not the cupboard I'd want there. Also, not really the cupboard I'd want either. Re alt it and we'll stick it over here. And then. It's so dark, but I don't really have the money to stick. Oh, I've spent a lot of money on the kitchen, of all things. Maybe a mistake, but at the same time, like, I also don't need these things technically, so maybe a big, big mistake, but. Um, I also have enough to be able to get one of these, which would be really nice, but it would go over that, basically. And then that would hopefully match it with the stairs, although it won't. Uh, but uh, but uh. Um, okay, so this should be an easy question to ask, but just give me a second, because I've got to double check what I'm actually, um... To make sure I've got this right. Um... <laughs> I don't really play any multiplayer games online, I'll be honest. Um, <laughs> I get scared by them. <sighs> Mainly when it comes to the need to speak to other people. Uh, specifically that I don't know. <laughs> I've just always been that way. Right, that's a nice little kitchen. The room would go here. I'm almost tempted, I'm not gonna lie. Yeah. I'm 
not too surprised that it's better to play them with friends. Um, I know, I just, I have a weird thing about it. I don't really know how to explain it. Because um, it just, it honestly probably seems really weird. Um, to have a bit of an oddity with it. See, I like this fence, but I don't really have a reason to be... There is a white version. I don't really have a reason to be using it, especially when it comes to that. Like, maybe... Oh, I wonder, is there a nice gate for it? I mean, there are a lot of white gates, to be fair. So any of them could probably work. I'm assuming this is the one it's meant to go with. Though that just doesn't fit. It also feels wrong for the type of fence. Like, that doesn't really feel right though, because it's got a weird thing. I've been, like, attempting to get better at, like, playing online, I will admit that. Um, but the one game I tried to attempt to play, which was Valorant, um, which is obviously online, um, it didn't work on my PC, so then I kind of was like, eh, never mind. I was just like, I must be being told something. <laughs> Why is that so- oh, there is a fence. I want like- I want it to go there though. Whoops. That didn't work. I honestly didn't even look at it to see if I typed it correctly. Well, oh, it just doesn't. On a slope! You wouldn't play that game, nor you have it installed if you saw the recent dirt on it, anyways. Yeah, that could be quite fun. Um, <laughs> I'd love to try one eventually. <laughs> But no, I basically, I was like, I'll try Valorant. My friend, um, one of my friends mentioned me like, oh, I'm going to get Valorant. I was like, okay, cool, I'll try it out. Um, and what happened with me was I couldn't play it, one, because it started making my, mon my monitors lose signal. And then I... <sighs> it also, like, broke other games I had. So, for example... Um, show the Tomb Raider didn't work for me anymore either. So it seemingly just is slightly broken, especially on PC because of its anti cheat, I believe. Uh, the anti cheat is broken, from what I understand. Yeah. And the only reason why I know it was Valorant is literally because I didn't have the game installed before, obviously, and everything worked fine. And then I installed it and it's anti cheat and it stopped, like it wasn't working. And other games weren't working. I uninstalled it and now it all works fine. <laughs> mm hmm. The anti cheat on PC is kernel level, which. If you don't know what that means, basically, the anti-cheat will start up when you turn your PC on. Which is absolutely insane to me, and is just kind of ridiculous. Um, like, and it, because it, it broke other things for me, so... <laughs> and it broke Valorant itself. Like, Valorant didn't work. It's weird. I need a good bed. 
Okay. This feels like a very like um what is that what was the show called? Yeah, I definitely kinda like the brown, which feels weird, but I want dark brown. This also feels like that reminds me of my grand's old bed. Like that could be alright, but I'd want a uh, light of wood. And by lighter I literally mean this colour wood, which I feel like I've managed to pick like the worst colour wood I could have for like anything else. <laughs> yeah. I mean, to be fair though, because Valorant has um kind of shot itself in the foot with how how strong its anti-cheat is. Um, because a lot of people immediately would just be like, I don't want to play it, it's it's that anti-cheat is just too much. Um, I don't feel comfortable putting it on my computer, basically. Um, there's a new game coming out called Hyperscape, I believe, which is very similar to Valorant. And a lot of people have been, be uh, been being like, oh, it's very similar to Valorant, blah, 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 blah. And the only way to get it currently is by like watching a Twitch streamer like play it for much time and have an account. It's all really weird. It's still in like its early like testing phases, I guess. I guess. Um... Which I haven't played. It looks really fast paced though, and I'm a bit like, hmm, maybe too fast paced for me right now. See, that's what I wanted. I wanted the bed like there, and then we could stick like a wardrobe down here eventually. Honestly, this could go up here. This painting could go center in the wall for now. But, any, like, I can't say much about the actual game and the gameplay in the community because I just haven't played it at the end of the day. Um, I personally did like Valorant's general style, so I don't know. Maybe if it decided to sort itself out with this anti shoot, I'd maybe give it a go again. And that is a very out there maybe. Should I put a pavement down there? Oh, I also need to build up more money. Why are they fighting again? Does mean she can do another emotional painting though. Oh, she's evil. That's why they're fighting this time. Makes more sense. <laughs> So, <sighs> they should have a choice in terms of their anti cheat. Because, like, they choose what their anti cheat is. They could use a different version, it didn't need to be kernel level. Yeah, they are a little bit. Like, I still have friends who play it, but. Look, I wouldn't complain about your cat sitting in front of the way, like, in the way. I'd be happy to have a cat in front of me right now. I'm gonna actually be seeing a cat that I should be able to, like, play with tomorrow, so I'm very excited about that. Also, this house is such a weird shape. You didn't make any mistakes, which is very impressive. I want them to leave. Okay, one sec. They just seem to come in. Also, <gasps> that's a glitch! One glitch apparently is just everyone making cakes. Like, all your sims making cakes constantly. Ugh. Also, that probably made sense on the other sides. I'm not a big fan of the game. Hey Undead, welcome to the stream! How did all your meetings go? I've just finished eating. <laughs> so, great timing there. So, uh, the glitch
knowledge here, it's nothing in terms of, um, like, what actually, like, there's no glitch that happens physically that you see, but it's basically, like, a weird thing that everyone seems to be having, where Sims just keep making cakes. Like, she's making another one, having just made this one. Like, it's, um, I suppose less of a glitch and more of a, um... A problem like it's broken um <laughs> it's the last hour of your week nice we like it when it's the last hour it's grand that's really cool oh are you nearly finished please the house is nowhere near done, but I really should be focusing on the restaurant I've been telling myself this is gonna be. Oh, that went for a lot. Okay, she can do another confident- she can do a confident paying. This feels very pointless, and I may get rid of it. This house is so weird. It's just such a weird shape. Like, I don't even see the roof on the top floor, but it's fine. It is building. We actually have a kitchen now, which is something. Soon we'll have a living room. I'm gonna put like a little dining table and chairs here to like under the stairs. I think that could be quite good. But two cakes. <laughs> we have a lot of cake. She didn't complete it. <laughs> she just did a level. What? Oh, she's tired now. Hopefully she'll get a better sleep than that. Oh, speaking of actually, sell that to a collector first, maybe. Oh, she's also everything else. <laughs> Can you stop making f like look all these cakes? This is what the problem is. Like they're just cakes. <laughs> You left it in the oven? You're gonna burn my house down! Go! Somehow that one's a normal quality. Oh my god. Are you trying to kill all of my sims? I can't even drag anything into the bin anymore, which used to be a thing. So I don't know what that's about. <laughs> okay, one set, one set, one set, one set. Uh, everyone but April. There we go. No one can come in now. What? I'm sorry, what? <laughs> this game's a little broken currently, unfortunately. <laughs> God's sake. I genuinely have no idea why this is happening. Like, there's just some guy making, like, a snowman on our lap, a lot and everything. Like, what? Fish taco honestly doesn't sound that great. Uh, no, thank you. I need to buy a bin for in here, I think. Um, that could be genuinely really useful. Um, do this and just like, there we go. Don't know why I feel the need to turn it, but it just feels off if I don't. There you go, so I should be able to rub it off into there now. 
Okay, you need to go to the toilet more than you need to do what you're currently in the middle of doing. Which I'm glad she actually just did do. Okay, she's gonna go have a shower and then she's gonna sleep. I hope those two people just die in my house. Like, look, I know I said earlier, like, I don't want anyone to die, blah blah blah, but they're really annoying me. I don't know if this is because it's a restaurant lot that this is having this issue. But I've locked the doors, they should be getting in anyway. Like... Mm. The bare necessities, the better bare necessities. The better no no no. Dylan Sigworth. And then you can come straight back to bed. Because, like, we tired, okay? <laughs> we are very tired. But I can appreciate, like, it's hard work being up and everything. <laughs> Me just being awake, even. Oh, we're doing the cat again. Nice. I swear to God, if you don't leave my house... Like, I am tempted to use extreme violence. <laughs> Make a masterpiece. Masterpiece. Please. Please make a masterpiece. We need the money. Can you stop talking? Oh, she's also a vampire. You want to stream one day? I mean, go for it. Why not? What's holding you back? You have to go for now, but you're most likely back before the stream is over. That's alright, I hope you have a nice rest of your day. I don't know what time you're in, but I hope it's a good thing. And if you're back, then I'll see you later. <laughs> okay, how much? Oh, noise. Oh. I still feel like this looks weird. Are you really just gonna stay in here? It's Winterfest! Have fun. I shall try my best, but these people... Oh, they may have to, uh... They may have to... Get murderous. I hope you have fun as well, by the way. <laughs> oh my gosh. Thank you for telling me about the screen capture I didn't mean to capture. The thing is, because they're all on my lot, it's making it really hard. So, like, okay, I'm just gonna use this to, um... Uh, I am from the UK, yes. Sim commands, I'm gonna have them... I'd like you to leave, really. That nice! Okay, apparently there's no way for me to do this. Why can I not just remove you? Uh, I'm actually currently in Wales. <laughs> um, but I've lived kind of all over just generally. Um, I'm moving soon, so I don't really want to... I don't, I'm really bad at geography. I'm trying to find a way to not have to say it because I don't know geography and I can... But don't really know where it is. Um, <laughs> but uh, I've typically lived in the south, though, um, and I'll be going back to south area uh, when I move next. I'm very much not in north. <laughs> I did live in the north for quite a bit, though. Uh, I went to uni in Bradford for a year. Um, 
but I'm not going there anymore. <laughs> but we are in Wales currently, yeah. Okay, there's no way for me to do this, so that's really frustrating. Maybe I just will have to kill them. Like, I don't want them making cakes constantly, it's really annoying. I don't think they can get out because I've now locked the door. I'm assuming the only reason why they were able to get in. I'm just gonna unlock it and see if they will leave or go outside or something. I think she might die soon to be honest. She's getting a little starved. She's gonna take the trash out. Okay, she's leaving now, which is nice to know. Yes, very much so. Um, gotta keep streaming the uh, six hours, you know? I actually haven't got too much long to go, now that I think about it. Yeah, it is. Wow, well, there's only like an hour and 15 minutes left. Insane in the membrane. Exactly. That didn't even click for me. I didn't realize it had gotten that long. To be honest, it doesn't feel like it's been as long as almost six hours. Maybe I'm just used to the idea of doing something for a long time because having worked or something. I don't know. It just feels like I'm. I have an enjoyable job at my computer, you know? And people to chat with, which helps. <laughs> Although this game is really annoying me that I can't drag anything into the bin. Um, and I have to go clean up everything individually. Pat the Badger? I haven't seen that in a while. Oh my gosh. What was that noise? Did you just kick that over? I will lock you in there and you will die in there. Would you like to leave? Yes, I thought you would. Can you s- oh my god. <sighs> All the cakes, really? Okay, she also needs to go to the toilet at this point. I could probably buy a better shower. Very soon. BLT. I don't like lettuce much, but to be honest. And I don't like tomato. Huh. I forgot that's what BLT meant. <laughs> Just bacon, please. Bacon and ketchup would be good for me. Uh, we'll need to repair that if she's eaten. Uh, but other than that, uh, let us do some more abstract paintings, please. She's also dehydrated. Uh, which I think is a mod anyway, um, which I'm not too bothered about. And also, oh, she wants to come in and I don't want her in, but I also have her in here. And I'm pretty sure she'll die eventually. No worries, Tazzle. I hope you have a good time. That's what I've decided to say instead of hoping you've had a good day or evening or whatever, because time zones are different for everybody at the end of the day. What are you embarrassed about? Can you just stop? 30 hands? Oh, she also needs to repair this. I just feel like, yeah. What? There it is. Ah uh, yes, the same painting. Did you see the funny picture I tagged you in? No. Nobody can tag me in a picture, because the only people who have pictures with me who are friends. Well, they can all tag me, I suppose. I don't know. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Speaking of, follow me on Instagram. <laughs> uh, unknown caller, creepy. We're fixing your phone line. Don't pick it up next the next time. Uh, hang up. Don't you want to? Oof. Bless. I'm getting distracted by a cat flow I've just seen. Okay, back to the Sims. 
A masterpiece. A masterpiece. What level am I? Why have I managed to do two masterpieces at level eight? That's ridiculous. Yes, I would like to sell the masterpiece. Oh. Meaning we're gonna come out here and transfer 4,000 over. We're gonna fix our bathroom, I think. Not that I've got any floors or tiles down or anything, so what are we actually doing here? Do, 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 do. Okay. So this just fits into the wall better, I'm gonna be honest. Uh, it did actually just use 2,000 and 100 simoleons up though, so... And I feel like this kind of works in the area with how clean it looks, so then I'm also just like, well... This... Fits better? I think that was more expensive, was it? Oh, a lot more. Also like this though... For like, an... Like, that looks cuter... Or not, I'm, I'm not really sure. You can't forget our little baby toilet roll. Which sits really high up for some reason, that's not the uh... Why is it every time I play this game, everything sits really high up? And you can't put anything down. It all just wants to go here, so I usually forgo having toilet roll because of this, but I'm gonna stick it there. And I'll just have to deal with it. Um, love to honestly have this. But like, it'll make it look like a little flannel. That just sits here. No, that looks silly. The bar of soap could be really good. Uh... It's not only the square braddocks that work for that, apparently. Brackets. Braggots. What? There you go. I also feel like that's actually, like, way too big for what it is. So I'm just gonna size it down and, like... Maybe need to bring it up a little bit more. No, that's actually fine. It looks fine, it looks fine. Maybe bring some teeth brush toothbrushes, oh my god. What is actually my English today? <sighs> Come on. I'm trying to place it off the grid and it does not want it to go off the grid. It's like that's really kinda cute. And I don't know where that's meant to go. Like, this would also match as a slope dispenser, but I think the soap feels better. Um, and then, like, maybe... The hand towel could be, like, here. Or even, like, here. Um, looks like a jail toilet. It is very much not. Do I annoy you? Um, I wouldn't say you're annoying, like, or really anything. I don't know you. <laughs> um, I hope it doesn't come across like I think you annoy me. Maybe a little higher up. Hopefully I don't annoy you. <laughs> Um, a medicine cabinet. There's so, like, such a big medicine cabinet, though. Like, that one's not any smaller. It also has gold on it. But that feels just so big. And you can't downscale them, either. I feel like that makes more sense. Just ask dumb stuff. I mean, 
I wouldn't say any question is a dumb question. Um, I've been told that many times myself, uh, that no question is a dumb question, because at the end of the day, if you don't know, um, you don't know, and better for you to find that out than to not, you know? Um, obviously when it does come to super, super personal information, like exact addresses and stuff, unless you know them personally and you're going to meet them, um, maybe don't. <laughs> Um, a lot of people also won't give you that information all the time. But questions are there to be asked at the end of the day. Okay, so the bathroom is basically complete and I actually still have quite a bit. I wonder if I have enough to get a TV. Not an on-the-wall TV, which makes me a little bit sad. I have enough to get this tiny TV, uh, which honestly could look very cute on a, like, a coffee table. But the problem, ugh, I need a console table more than a coffee table. Oh, there, that's really cute. Oh, there could be a fireplace. Although that's a terrible place for a fireplace there. It'd have to go over here. But then that feels really in the way of the stairs. But it almost makes more sense. What is nice, custom content doesn't come with the like, oh, we um, are problematic to your like eco footprint, which I appreciate. I'm like, thank God. Green fish hat here, you also have to agree just by going off the chat log, you don't think that's annoying. <laughs> exactly. Uh, grey, black, how about brown? That doesn't really look nice though, that brown. Brown, that brown's way too light. <laughs> that's just not brown, that's yellow. Like, that's kind of cute, but doesn't feel very, like... I kind of want that, but it's literally 2000. Uh, why are you 2000? <laughs> Like, that could also work. Like, there. And then, the reason why I want this is because I could stick a TV in it. Um, and then chairs and sofas and that. I think it's looking quite cute. We used to do uh, Let's Plays on YouTube a few years ago and transition and share... Uh, blah, blah, blah. I've missed a message. Also, if you hope to start streaming, it's the best time to do it now. Yeah. You might as well, like, if you have spare time, stream. It's exactly what I did. Um, I actually had someone here earlier who recently joined my Discord who said about wanting to start streaming, asked me for a few tips, and, like, um, the main tip I always give, really, when people ask me, which isn't very often, I'll be honest, is just do it, and try not to get disheartened if you're not getting the double digit viewers or if you're not getting more than one or two or even if you have zero um at the end of the day if you want to do it um you should do it and with time you will build an audience it how long that time is um i can't say for sure no one can really say for sure are you just doing on Sundays because that's the best time you can fit into your free time? Yeah, exactly. Yeah, it, it can be really hard. Um, and it can be very frustrating as well. Um, like, I understand it. I do get it. <laughs> I'm very lucky to be getting the amount of viewers I get in the space of time that I've been streaming. Um, but... I usually feel awkward when I start getting, to, like, when people point it out a lot of the time, I'm like, yeah, that's really cool. Because uh, I don't necessarily, like, mention it all the time, because it's just like, oh, yeah, I have that view, it's, that's cool, but I'm having fun. <laughs> so, less than point is seeing the same people continue to stop buying, so, exactly. It's, the viewer number doesn't matter, because you'll have eventually someone who decides that they want to stay. Like, Undead, for example, um, 
pop by one of the streams and you've almost been to every single one since. Um, which is insane and I can't thank you enough because damn you've watched a lot of me <laughs> just sat here playing games. Hey Felina, welcome to the stream. That vampire just screamed her little hungs out. Um, but those who keep coming back are the ones who, who me, yes you. Also, I need to get more money again. I always get distracted when I'm talking. I'm like, <laughs> I can barely commentate when talking about things. Uh, I'm doing quite well, yeah. Uh, I've been streaming for nearly five hours at this point. <laughs> This house is slowly but surely building up into something. Shame that the restaurant hasn't got anything going on with it. Oops. Oh uh, uh, yeah, it's been going, going quite well. Um, we played The Escapist 2 earlier. By the way, if you want it free on Epic Launcher, so go ahead and get it. Um, it was a little awkward because we didn't really know what we were doing because it was our literal first time playing it. Me and Sam played it earlier. Um, we also... <laughs> I found multiplayer is a bit of a pain. It's a little awkward. You can't invite friends yet on Epic. Um, so it's a bit naff. But we figured it out. You can just do a public server with a password. Um, oh, that was a masterpiece. Amazing. And then, which went quite well. We had quite a few people stop by. New people as well. And got some new followers, which I'm really appreciative of them. Um, and then... We swapped over. I was originally going to be playing Prison Architect and then I couldn't see my cursor on the game and I was like, I'm not going to be able to play this if I can't see my cursor. <laughs> so <laughs> I didn't. I moved on to this. <laughs> uh, playing games you enjoy and achieving your stream style consistent, uh, archiving your streams consistency, you'll build up a catalogue of your best moments for new people who stop by to enjoy when you're in stream because you're bored. Yeah, exactly. I, I don't do much with my VODs, I'll be honest. I just leave them up. I don't highlight them. I don't put any highlights of any of my streams up. Mainly because I'm really lazy. Um, I actually, while I am streaming quite a bit, and I want to continue the amount of streaming I'm doing, I've been wanting to get into, like, YouTube again. But, like, not gaming YouTube. But I don't... Like, my head was like, it'd be fun to, like, do a commentary video. But one, absolutely no idea what I'd commentate over. And then two, it's like, it's so much effort <laughs> to do something like that in that style without, like, if you actually script it and stuff. Um, so I was like, ugh. <laughs> then I also do want to start highlighting my streams, like, in YouTube content. I have every single one of my streams downloaded. Uh, it's just, like, me thinking... Every time I do, like, a lot of the time when I do a stream after I finish one, I'm way too tired to do anything with that stream, other than download it and sort out my YouTube stuff and that, uh, for the stream we upload. And then, <laughs> other than that, I'm just like, I don't know if this was interesting enough to put down into, like, a highlight reel. And then by the time I've maybe thought about actually trying to do it, I've forgotten what's in what the videos anyway. <laughs> Um, also, just going through three hours worth of footage, not fun. Uh, long time. I'd be tempted to maybe do the Escapist 2 one though. I don't know how good that would be, but like, maybe. Totally didn't realise the bathroom wall was cut away, but she just sat down and opened to it. Nah, sh there, there, there is very much a wall. <laughs> Luckily, we wouldn't want to see that, you know? She's hungry because she's a vampire, and you're stuck in my house, and she's also just here. Oh, it's not fun, and like, I used to find it really entertaining, and then I did a college course for media, where like, you'd have so much footage, and it would just be there like, I have to get this project done. 
And now that I don't have to do it, my brain's like, haha, just don't do it. <laughs> I'm like, haha, yeah. Um, you'd rather engage with your audience and community. Exactly. Twitch is really good for that. Because um, obviously people can chat with you live and you can respond to them live. Um, you know. <laughs> um, I think the nice thing about YouTube for a lot of people is they can essentially monitor what they say before it becomes live. Um, and at the end of the day, it's something that's easier to handle. Like, if you feel like you didn't say something quite right, you can just re-say it and it's not a problem. Or if you feel like, oh, maybe that was a bit too, like, out there to say, you can just change the way you say it, re-record it, and then edit that bit instead. Um, I can understand why to some people live streaming is a bit like, oh, maybe not. <laughs> um, but like you, I also was like, I'd rather live stream because editing is just that much effort. And to a certain degree, I trust myself to not say anything too bad. Because um, I'm just not that way anyway. Like, I, I don't worry about me actually saying bad things. <laughs> she needs to sleep. I'd like it if Lily Vator would I leave? But, like, my brain's like, do something else, write something. I think I just want to write something, is my actual issue. <sighs> I actually have a um, report I did uh, on typography a long time ago. I think I've mentioned this a few times. And I'm tempted to read it out and do like a video essay version of it. Um, just because it's already written and all I have to do is film it edit it and then throw things up on the screen i think it'd be quite cool um if uh and if the first thing i say is just something dumb rather than something offensive then i'll just laugh it off and make it enjoyable exactly i don't think i'm a offensive person just generally um i don't try to be uh so it's just like what i'm probably gonna say is more stupid than anything else So, and at the end of the day, you've got to learn to laugh things off. Uh, you're very good at laughing at your dumb. I like to think I am. <laughs> it happens often. <laughs> I just sometimes miss, like, very obvious things that I shouldn't have. But at the end of the day, you've got to learn to laugh at yourself. Like, if you can't, then it's a bit like, you're going to hurt yourself more than you're going to hurt anyone else. Um, in those sort of situations, but you obviously don't want to be hurting yourself. And I think definitely on something where you have live interaction, um, I have watched a few people who, where, like, someone will say something that isn't necessarily, like, mean mean, but it's kind of just like, oh, um, like, why'd you do this thing, for example, which sounds like kind of just a general question, but we'll get, but they'll, like, the streamer would get a little bit offended, like, why do you mean what I, like, why do I do this? I do this because I want to, like, you can't tell me what to do sort of thing, and I'm like, oh, <laughs> like, Coram, it's okay, they were just asking a question, it's just like, you could just, I don't know, but you gotta laugh about it. There's always gonna be some more people, and when it gets too bad, you know, time them out, ban them. 55 minutes left, indeed. Oh my god! I mean, she should have gone home. Like, I mean, I, I don't know what you wanted from me here. Like... It, no, it, yeah, it tells us right. Not, um, it's till the end of the stream. Not, um, not time challenge. God, I don't think you could do this timed, really. Because the ending of this is really just kind of whenever you want it to end, I guess. Ah, yes, let me just put the roof up. Maybe that will become my new desktop screen. <laughs> 
god. Freaking, what even is your name? You basically say, hello Dowie. Hey, at least Lilith the talk. That isn't gonna happen to Lilith. Then again, I might just kill Lilith because she is so annoying. She's just in my house. I'm just trying to find something that isn't too, like, you know? I hope she just- actually, do you know what? She might die on her own. We should- we'll sh thumbnail right there. Exactly. It's not the first death- why are you crying? Why are you sad? Why? Like- you didn't even really know her. I don't even think you were friends. Okay, you weren't really friends, but you know. Bye. But isn't that one a lot though? So maybe we'll keep her. She's just in a little fence. <laughs> She's gonna die soon if she doesn't try and eat my sim. Should I come to my house? You know. Rip. <laughs> Very much. I wish I could actually pop it on screen. Um, there you go. Rip. Um, it'd be a lot easier to do that if my stream deck, uh, on my app, if the stream deck app was working. But there we go. Rip. <laughs> okay, my sim is actually hungry, so, you know, instead of crying, why don't you come and have some mac and cheese? Because that is definitely my type of comfort food. I mean, to be honest, pasta is my type of comfort food. <laughs> oh, gosh. Oh, it sounded like you just said, no, gentle? Dude, I ain't done nothing to you. How about you leave? I can name this gnome now. I think he's mad at me, though. Hello, naked gnome. Hello, naked gnome. How are you doing? Wait, wink. I don't really want her to like try and eat me. If she doesn't seem to be, I don't know if she's really registering that like I'm here and existing. Also, like, it feels weird to have the bathroom by the kitchen, but like, at my sister's old house, she had. It where you'd have to walk through the kitchen, like properly through it. It's so, like you had the living room, like here, the kitchen, and then the bathroom. There, not that you can really see my hand. Are you gonna eat this? You're actually full. I like you are. You're very thick, and um, you're looking less like me. <laughs> Which is funny because I may not be that thick, but I am. I've got some weight to me. <laughs> Sounds so mean, but like, it's just the truth. I have weight. <laughs> At least it's to me. <laughs> Cameron is cooling. There's something that I have to ask you. To me, it's painfully obvious, but I want to get your take. Do you think we're in a simulation right now? I mean, you are a sim. Exactly, I saw it in Simspedia. That's what it said. Yeah, the reason why I'm saying yes is because... <laughs> actually, though. Narshko. I expect to get it's existential. No, I think it's something new that was actually added to the game. Uh, whether you get random calls. But there's also a mod coming out to, like make more of it happen like for it you to get new different ones which i'm really interested in uh when it comes out i'm quite excited for it whoa i didn't realize we had that much money uh yes this is modded um it's not the not that speech bubble specifically but there is a mod um that someone is bringing out to have like more of them uh but I do have a lot of mods in my game. I think th there's a panel below showing them. But for example, um, this Extreme Violence is a mod, which I, I don't really want to do it in this gameplay. Um, and it allows you to murder people. So 
<laughs> don't play since you don't know what's modded and what isn't. He wasn't aware there was mods. Oh. Uh, so there's actually, I actually have quite a few mods in my game. Um, so for example, um, this Simda dating app where you can, where basically it's online dating, that's a mod. Um, I don't have all the mods in my game currently. Slice of Life is a mod, so uh, this is like your pills, so drugs. Um, you have skincare stuff, so um, basically people get acne. Uh, it also adds some like more things to the emotions, uh, so like blush if you're flirty, tears if you're sad. I wonder actually, my sim is sad, I wonder if I can maybe get in there and show you what I mean by the tears. Um, so you can see like that little bubble on her eyes there that's like a half semicircle. Uh, that's part of that mod. Um, also in that mod specifically, uh, you also have this thing called party invites where you'll get invited to parties and you can accept them and whatnot. Um, there's also this fitness thing now uh, where I think it just helps you understand how much like what their weight distribution is. Uh, you can get ill for, with this as well, so that helps uh, in terms of making things more realistic. And it gives you a few extra things for the phone. Um, what other mods do I actually have? I took a lot of the ones that add these menus in because they are really overboard sometimes. But you have all of this. Um, what other mods do I use? Also, actually, one thing I can take you into quickly, and I will just cheat into the modifying cast. Another thing that's a mod that you may not realize is a mod, I also have a bunch of custom content. Mods and custom content in the sim are different. Custom content is content that people have created that are cast items. So, for example, anything with this wrench is custom content. So there's also stuff in build by mode that's custom content. The counters in the kitchen I've used as custom content. Um, why did I come in here though? Oh, I have uh, custom traits as well. Um, I also have a few custom careers. Um, bunch of custom hair obviously because it's lackluster. Why else did I come in here? What did I say I was going to look at? I think I was just going to say about the custom content. Um, but yeah, so there's there's quite a bit in here. Uh, I have a lot of it. My like mods folder is probably around four or five gigs, um, which is quite a bit. But actually, do you know what? I can check. <laughs> Shall I check? This could be really underwhelming or shocking. So, oh, it's seven gigs. <laughs> a re. <laughs> um. So yeah, I have a lot of mods. What other mods do I actually have? That's me. Oh, that's what I was going to say. This column. Uh, yeah. Last time I was going to say it was like one or two. Two does actually have mods and custom content in it. Uh, I don't know about one. I think kind of. I guess it makes sense that they'd have the ability to mod the game, just wasn't aware of them. It's a good game for mods and custom content. Uh, definitely, I agree. Uh, they genuinely make the game better. Um, like, a lot of people can't play without them because the game feels very empty otherwise, but Sims 2, I know for definite, did have custom content and I'm pretty sure also had mods in it. So it's been moddable for quite a while. Um, but... This, um, the five columns here, it's usually only two columns, and obviously because of all the custom content I have, not in that section, uh, but because of all the custom content, as you can see, this is very, very small. Uh, it's a lot easier to search through if I have more. <laughs> um, I've also got, like, other things. What is this? No, thank you. Oh, okay. I put it in so it won't work. Um, MC Command Center is something that I use a lot. It does help uh, manage your game a little better. And that's in there, which allows you to do quite a lot of in-depth things to your sims. It also adds, it adds story progression into the game, which does not exist still, I don't think, in the original version if you don't have it. Which basically means that characters outside of your family home will like get married, get pregnant, you know, adopt and stuff. Um, so I have quite a bit of mods. Um, there's a lot of stuff you can do uh, in this game with mods, and it's great, and I love it. <laughs> oh. 
sell that to a collector, please. Didn't actually realize they had this much money. Uh, what did I say I was going to do next? Um, I needed three, like, four thousand for it or something that I said I was going to do. Uh, but apparently, I do not remember. It was like 4,200. Like, surely I would remember this. I went on a tangent, that's why I can't. Oh, for TV! That makes a lot more sense. <laughs> Um, so for one on the wall, there is this one, but it's really tiny, so let's just not. There is this tabletop, but there's also the wall version, which actually isn't nearly as much as I thought it was going to be. It feels wrong for a cottage, but then so does just a flat TV in general. Like, it should be one of these, I'd feel like, on, like, a small little thing. And it is kind of a modern cottage. Oh no, I know what it was. It was the fireplace. I said I wanted this. Oh, it's actually a full brown one. That's exciting. There's this one. Where I like that a lot actually. And then what I do is, oh I don't have the money for the TV. It's literally so close. So we'll just wait for a second. Um, let's just paint another thing. Get me a masterpiece. Not that I actually need a masterpiece to be able to do what I want to do, but you might as well. <laughs> um, not me. Ah, trait to prayers. I was gonna say. The amount of time she's painted this cat painting now really upsets me because, like, I just assumed we weren't going to be able to get it again, which is why I have it here. And I just didn't sell it on, like, earlier. Oh, but that was... Oh my god, she's now a rising star celebrity. This was not the plan. This is not what I planned. And I realize I've said that and it sounded honestly really weird. Um, High School Musical. The weird movies are amazing. See, I was tempted to do that myself, and then I became lazy, so I didn't. Um, but no, that's amazing. I love it. But what I can do is I can um put the TV if it will actually not clip. Oh, goodness gracious. Oh, is it... Do I not have the mod, uh, the cheat on? Okay, maybe I can't use the wall TV anyway. Um, but I can just move this up like this. Which it is very much floating, and I hate it, so maybe I won't. But maybe this TV... And again, it's another wall TV, and it doesn't snap off of the wall. Hmm. Maybe this one, because it's just got a bigger stand. At least that way it will still look like it's stood on it, I guess. This is also a modded TV, and the only slight issue with the modded TVs, from my personal experience, is that they don't necessarily work correctly. Um, which is why I was hoping to use one of these. And I've seen other people do it. I don't know why I can't. I think I'm just actually a little incapable. It might be more fiddling than I'm worth trying to deal with. I also can't- oh. <laughs> that is way way too in the wrong place, okay. Also very intriguing, so it didn't used to be as easy. Uh, for example, we've only recently got a door update that allows us to move these on half tiles uh, and also alt place them, 
which is very fun and I do appreciate. It's very useful. Um, but a lot of this stuff, I'll be honest, like move objects on the cheat, which allows me to place this like in other objects basically. I wouldn't be able to do this otherwise. Um, didn't exist for a very long uh, didn't exist for a while in this game. Um, it just wasn't there. Which a lot of people were very mad about, by the way. Um, yeah, I think like that, that's good. Um, and then we could have, not that there's actually the space for it, we'll stick this little gnomey boy on top here though. Although he doesn't really fit that size, so we'll just turn, size him down. Um, I don't know, I like the custom placement, it makes things easier to fit in and just look more real. Um, but none of this stuff, when uh, EA actually builds these houses and stuff, and the Sims team build these houses, they're not allowed to use the custom placement stuff, they're not allowed to use bb.moveobjects on, um, because they can break when you um, load them onto the lot, I, like lose doors and stuff. It's not, it's not fun, but <laughs> it is what it is. Tempted by like this little lamp right by the stairs. I'd also be tempted to put it in a completely different place, like actually in that corner, but I think I could fill that with plants. Um Unfortunately, my only issue with that is that because I've got this front bit here, which really does help break up the front of the house. Um but because of where I've placed this, it won't... One sec, let me see if I... Oh, I just clicked off the game. Let me get a little chimney. What sort of chimney would I need? Is probably the better question I need. Like, I don't know what colour these bricks are. I think they're like a brown. Like, that honestly probably fits better. Also at the same time, like, this would work. Okay, let me just go up. And I'm gonna have to figure out how I'm gonna place it. Because it's on that wall. But it's in between these two. So it's actually more like there. Like, is that floating now? Oh no, it is in it. Okay, never mind. It may be floating a little bit. Oh, is it because this is like not up? No, that's such a weird design. I want to use it though. Okay, I can actually just put it down myself. Although it should literally be there, I'm pretty sure. Yeah. I'm actually gonna... oh god's sake. I'm just gonna bring this down... Oh, okay, that's as far as it'll go. That's also where it should be though, in terms of the actual chimney placement. I don't think it matches too much. <laughs> At least not on the inside to the outside. But it's definitely a start. Also, look at all these glasses. This house also really needs um needs a clean. And you need to leave. I want her to die, but I don't think she's dead like she's going to. Also, this should be on warmer. Okay, there we go. Oh, jeez. That's still in the wrong place for me. 
actually just comes slightly through the wrong place, but we can we could probably say that it's like actually just how it is. <laughs> I've never made such a simple little house before and I'm quite happy with it. She says, having really made no houses before and um only ever copying them. Not like actually stealing, but just for my own use in the game. Or, or I can't build shells for nothing. Is this freaking come get your sister, Caleb? She is actually stepping on my toes at this point. Maybe she'll leave. Oh my god, another person's walked in my house. And they're siblings, by the way, so I will kill them both. You're vampires, I'm not scared to just kill you guys. Like, I can't ask him to leave. And they both have guns! Do I just do it? Can you move out the way so I can actually fix my fridge? Thank you, but like, no thank you. I'll pat the baba. Baba? Badger. How little you have done for us. Oh shit. Yeah, she's a little dazed, so I wouldn't have her do that again, otherwise she may actually die. Oh, we have a TV now. Perfect. Oh, can you not put that up there? I wish to kill them. But I also kind of don't want to kill them because I don't want me to be the one killing them. I feel like I'd be fine if it wasn't, like, actually my sim self doing it, but... <laughs> Please leave my house. Oh my god, especially if you're gonna fight with me. Okay, you have... Just caused a fire in my house, Lilith. One, I'm gonna extinguish it. Do you know what's gonna happen then, seeing as you've just wasted my money? Um, and now you're fighting me? I'm sorry. But eat a grilled cheese, yeah? You're a vampire, so you're not even gonna like this. I can't believe I've just had to spend my money on that. Like, eat this grilled cheese for me, yeah? I'm gonna just move away. I know, she's cooking food she won't even eat. It's so... Like, can it just end? Oh, that is... Honestly... Horrific. Yes, I did murder her. You're right. Um, and we're not um we're not done yet. That was an aggressive phrase. Um, because I said deadly interactions. Um, and then you know. We we did this and. I think for this one, I'm just going to click Slay Vampire before he decides to um, go yell about the fact that I've killed his sister. Oh, you're- oh, you're- yeah, 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 I don't know. 
I did actually uh, do that myself. Um, I don't know why um, it's flagged you for it. I'm gonna clean myself up. Um, I have no idea. Weird stuff. I should have just done because she ain't gonna dis. I'm afraid she might not disappear. <laughs> Tazzle's just like, well, I didn't expect that to happen. I'm leaving, uh, so I'm not like a witness to this. <laughs> no, I'm kidding, but no worries. I hope you have a nice afternoon. I should just say a nice time. I don't know why I keep trying to guess the time. Um, no, I have yet. I hope you have a nice time. Bye, boy. Come on, Grim. You're allowed in the house. You should know you're bypassed. Also, the Vator siblings, uh, they're meant to be like the friendly vampires, but they just both try to like beat me up, so. I like how for one of them she was like, yeah, killed a vampire, and the other one she's just like, yeah, I murdered someone. <laughs> like, great. <laughs> and like, she's not doing anything. <sighs> oh, I'm just gonna reset them. There we go. Fine. Also, I need to lock this door. Oh, everyone's at my house now. Hey, hey. Choke on a girl cheese. That was so unnecessarily violent. Yeah, that also got removed from it. I mean, she set my house on fire while trying to make stuff, like cook stuff, so that was my reasoning. <laughs> oh, bad. Can you sleep please? Is someone on this lot again? How are you in my house? And when did you get in my house? Oh my god. I don't want to kill you, Cameron. You're actually really lovely. You're not, like, trying to start a fight with me every time. Not breaking my fridge, actually. I'm gonna have her serve dinner and get herself a garden salad. I don't know why. Garden salad of all things, but... Bing bong! <laughs> Did you see that in the corner? She just went, do 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 do. Like, oh, so slowly. <sighs> come on, come on, come on. Do 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 do. Okay, I don't know why I'm singing like the East Enders theme, I think it is. Pretty sure it's not Coronation Streets. Well, just get copy strikes, like. <laughs> but oh yeah. Also, I need to clean that. Can you like not come back in my house though? Rule. <laughs> mm -mm. cool. 
My sim is not naked, she has just not had her clothes reload. I feel like I needed to make that clear. Um, not naked, just unloaded clothes. Oh god, I don't want the garden salad to go bad. Go in. Are you just gonna take garden salad out of my fridge? And leave it to the side? Uh, I feel like if I had kept doing that noise for any much longer, it would have sounded like freaking Chewbacca. That should not be stuck in my head. I'm so annoyed. I have to have a clean every single one of these glasses. What happens like not putting a dishwasher on until it's full? Apparently, Let's do another one. She's making a lot of profit on it at this point. Wish that would stop. <laughs> Get it in stock in my uh, 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 I head. Da 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 da. I feel like this isn't very abstract. Like it's just okay. So you have sun, sun rays. I'm like evening. <sighs> she actually does need to go down here though. There's oil already spoilt food? Does the food not even last a day here? Oh, um, well, I can still do a, um, a medium abstract, so that's fine. Why can't I? Oh, oh no. Oh, no. So if you don't know what I'm saying, oh, no. I can't. Oh shit. Um. I need a computer to be able to do that stuff. But I can't even go into here to get a computer. Can I travel? Oh, I can't do that while Sim is dying either. I got rid of- I reset the sim, like, she shouldn't be dying technically anymore. Oh no! I just don't want to keep looking at a dead body, and I've suffered for it apparently. So basically, I may not be able to save this game. I haven't saved this entire period of three hours that I've been playing. Because I've reset the sim. But not even because of that, because I appar apparently 
Choco and grilled cheese just didn't allow her to die. Well, the Grim seemed to be broken, at least. Is she still here? Can I summon her? Revive the Sim. I don't think this is going to work either. She'd rather not come. Please come. Can I force you to come? Okay. So we're just gonna... do the whole... Um, set on fire. <laughs> Just gonna clean ourselves up here. Oh, bloody fam. <laughs> um, so I'm trying to see if this will fix my um issue. Basically, I can't do this while Sim is dying. So when she died originally, um, she never actually seemed to finish uh, her death sequence. Um, and I'm trying to see if it fixed it, which it did. As you can see, Caleb and Lilith both now have urns that we can keep. Um, and it actually fixed my problem. Otherwise, I wouldn't have been able to save. <laughs> Is the whole reason why I did that. Um... Oh, great. So I now have a uh, three bat things here. Which I'd like if you didn't come into my house. Yeah. Yeah. I mean... We killed them both, so... We didn't actually kill Helena. Uh, she burned to death in the sunlight as a vampire, so that's not my fault. <laughs> we kill the other two, though. They should have been up in my house and starting fights and costing me over a thousand simoleons to, uh... You know, because they decided... Lilith decided to burn my freaking oven down. Also, who are you now? Oh my god, this is so annoying. Get out of my house! Like, what is your problem? Leave. Oh my god, not again, not again, not again, not again, not again! Why is there always something dirty in here, by the way? He's breaking all of my shit. How annoying. Okay, let me just put a house down, uh, a sofa. I have so many to choose from. This is actually really nice. I do like it quite a bit actually, and it's eco living, so. I feel like it'd even fit in this area if I had a darker wood. Although, like, not what I'm going for, I guess. I'm going for more like old grandma sort of sofa. like Loki. Like this really fits. Like no, 
do 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 do. Hmm. I think I am gonna move this all over slightly. Oh, that means I have to move the TV. There we go. Um, these are gonna be though. Like, I want some colour, but honestly, they probably would be best, like, a light brown. The dark kind of darkens it. Maybe even the colour you were. I kind of like that. That's fine. And then a rug would be super nice to fit in here. Like, honestly, even that colour complements it really well. Well, I said that and I've kind of disagreed with myself after saying it. <laughs> honestly, that looks nicer. And I could actually tie in that blue by using the swatch here. But I prefer the lighter colour. Maybe even green. Like... So for the most part, the downstairs is going to be wood floor. Speaking of, it's going to be wood floor. How about I actually make that happen? Although that's really dark. So is that, but I'll be honest, that's the colour. Uh, we're going to need a tile for the kitchen now. Which, honestly, I always default to this, but it feels way too modern to be in here. Um, so honestly, something like this would be better. Um, which feels honestly really outdated. But like, definitely maybe that way. I think I need a coffee table in here. Should also uh, probably do the bathroom. Which honestly, I wouldn't be against just doing the whole thing like that. Honestly, actually, kitchen tile can be like that really ugly color. And then the bathroom tile can be that. That works for me. That works for me. Oh, <laughs> Uh, I'm I'm not worried too much about the walls right now because honestly we can leave the walls and it'll be fine. So let's put a coffee table in. I'm not gonna want like a rat, although it kind of works. Although I kind of want just a square coffee table because I think it fits. I don't want anything that's got holes in it because everything's gonna get put down on it. In that case, honestly, that gives me like the grammar vibes that I'm looking for. That does too, but not quite as much as I like. Hmm. Do, 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 do. Maybe something like that. But it needs to be... It just doesn't feel right. Honestly, neither does the colour of these sofas, though. I feel like they need to match the rug fully or not at all, so I'm going to match it. Um... This could be really good. Is there like the actual version of it? Okay, it's from Laundry Day apparently. Laundry Day, Laundry Day. Where is it? Here 
There it is. It's like this. But like, obviously further back and centered. Like, there is this smaller one, but it doesn't feel like it makes as much sense there. Um, and then what i do with this is I'd probably put some flowers on it. Not that, that's not really enough for me. Oh, that is too big. Like, okay, so that could be like the center maybe. Although, I think these lilies would do better being the center. So basically what I'm going to do is I'm going to figure out, oh, that's going to be so annoying. Because I don't want it there, I want it in the middle. I'm just going to move the carpet for a minute. Because I want it on this line, which you'll see what I mean when I put it over here. Um, what's nice is these have kind of stuck to where they would be. Uh, and what I'm going to do is I'm just going to create like a little middle thing here. Something that just feels like kind of grandma, you know? Do 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 Yeah, that doesn't work. Okay, now let's put the table back in. Which isn't quite the center I wanted it, but like, um, I want it. F there we go. I think that all kind of ties it in a little bit. So I now actually have every single part of this house fully functioning, other than the wallpaper and stuff, which I understand is quite important. At the same time though, I'm tempted to like have just like a like um pink siding like left in here to give like that cabiny vibe. Like across one wall sort of situation. Honestly, I think behind here, it goes really well with like the blue, and it makes sense um, that one side would be still in that sort of situation. Um, and then everything else, I don't necessarily want it to be super dark. Um... But like, I could keep it pink. I think that looks really weird. Honestly, I think this brown makes a lot more sense. Is like that. And maybe even continuing over, but at the same time, like, no. Um, but I'd be tempted to even have this just fully for this room up here. But maybe with a different colour paint. Maybe this is where we'd bring the pink back in, or even the um, blue. Well, me saying that I didn't want a dark wallpaper puts a dark wallpaper in. <laughs> Oof. 
Uh, but now all we need is like tiling sort of thing. Which I'd love a half tile, but like the ones in here usually aren't that nice. Unless you use just this white one. Even then, it doesn't like come up enough of the wall for me to be happy with it. This one. But it feels too. And then in the bathroom, I do the like full white. Sorry. And then like behind here, I'm just gonna stick it like that. I need to seal the walls. And like that, and even on the door, and like halfway. Because like you don't necessarily want to get wet there. Um, I don't think I can afford necessarily any lights. We do actually have some money in here, so I'm just gonna move over 500. And I might be able to get some lights. <laughs> I do love these, they are so pretty. At the same time, every time I size them down. And it truly does feel kind of like the lighting I'd expect. In like a little house like this. Like, I wouldn't expect anything more. Oh, I just can't afford it. Except maybe in the kitchen. Oh, I was going to put a little dining table and chairs there, wasn't I? Oh, that doesn't quite fit anymore. <laughs> no, do you know what? I'd leave it like that there too. It's nice to finally have a lit up house. I won't say that much. Um, one other thing I might do though, ooh, I have just realized I haven't done this wall. Is, I'm gonna go ahead and, ooh, I don't actually think I have enough money. It's almost at six hours, it's got a couple of seconds until it is. <laughs> but yes, almost there. I want to stick... <sighs> Do you know what? Let's move a hundred more civilians over. I don't know if it's going to be enough. Oh, uh, okay. I need to uh, very quickly do another painting. But look, the house is almost done. How exciting. Which is why I'm actually going to do another painting right now. Um, instead of letting her sleep, because she actually does really need to sleep. <laughs> but we are so close. Uh, it is now six hours. We have in fact done the six hour live stream, which I am very happy with and I'm very glad I've managed to do it, because it was a long way. I didn't know if I was actually going to be able to play games for this entire time, and I managed to, so yay! Uh, speaking of, we need to go repair all of this stuff. She's too uncomfortable to do anything, and unfortunately, unless she fixes this toilet, she won't be able to do it. She won't become uncomfortable. She won't become not uncomfortable. She also desperately needs a shower. No, she's not too uncomfortable anymore, though. Basically, I want to break up this wall so that it doesn't feel so weird that it just stops there. It's like, the only other thing I can think of doing, obviously this room is not fully done in any sort of way. Oh my god, why are you miserable? The only other way I can think about doing it is if I was to make this an entire wall and have an arch here. That would feel extremely closed off and I'm not too happy about the idea of that. You could have literally have just slept in your bed and you chose to not do that. 
But no, I'm quite happy with the idea of the pink being here. Um, and like it being beige down there, because unfortunately with the blue, it feels like it would be a little bit too much. Okay. I just need this painting done so I can do the little thing that I want to do. And I don't even need as much smolens as this is going to get me. Come on. Stop talking. Talk to each other, not to me. <laughs> oh, for goodness gracious. Quick calf brunch, have a BLT. Or pass out, I guess. Hey, six hours, yeah! <laughs> I did hit 100 followers, yeah! It's been a good day, all in all. I did a six hour live stream and I hit 100 followers today. So, can't complain, second time, remember the follow bots. <laughs> Don't, actually, because they're not worth it, but you know, <laughs> it's low-key funny. I'm just happy that she actually has a fully functioning house now. Now it's time for the restaurant, yay! Well, not actually, I will be ending off very, very soon. actually stop eating it takes so long for some reason you are invited i've been invited to an event apparently okay let's sleep enough i can't speed up any more than it is which is so frustrating because there are people in the house but on the lot just generally and she's so close to finishing this painting too which is even more frustrating. Come on. Yeah, better sleep. Come on, come on. Yes. Okay. Now we can do it. <laughs> Uh, I'll just go over 900. Basically, all I wanted to do was to come in here, to come in here, to come in here, and oh, I need the other one. One set. This one is the one I actually need. And to put this down, which kind of breaks up the wall enough for me to be happy with it, and then eventually I'll do anything and everything else for that. Uh, however, that is in fact the end of this stream. So I want to thank you to anyone who joined, to anyone who popped in, to anyone who has chatted at all throughout six hours of the stream. It's gone really well, surprisingly, which I didn't expect because in my head you stream out of your normal time and then things go terribly bad. But I guess I was proven wrong today. Um, I hit 100 followers and that's great and amazing. And thank you to everyone. I'm going to hurry off because... I'm actually quite tired and, you know, like, I got stuff to be doing. So thank you so, so much once again. And I will not be streaming tomorrow. Um, I'll be, sh I won't be streaming Monday either. I'll be back on Tuesday. Um, if I'm up early, early enough, I may be streaming tomorrow. But the likelihood is not. Go ahead and follow me on Twitter, Discord, all of that stuff. And I'll update you whether or not I'm actually streaming tomorrow at some point tomorrow. Obviously, if it's gone past uh, probably around 4 p.m., expect not. Um, 4 p.m. BST specifically. But I'll see you all tomorrow. Not tomorrow. Tuesday for definite. Um, I've I've got some busy. I've got a busy weekend. But I will see you all Tuesday. <laughs> bye bye.